And what is this crazy fellow over here? Is this one of those newfangled robots that goes around the store and hands you things? Excuse me, sir, I'd like a cheeseburger. You can bring it to my room. Lettuce, but no pickle. All right, guys, today we are in Springfield, Missouri. I was planning on filming in Arkansas today, but I mapped it all out wrong, probably with my one eye, and I ended up in the mountains somewhere. I don't even know where. Something springs. Anyway, we are at Battlefield Mall, about to go into a Spirit Halloween that's in an old Sears. For some reason, the sign is way down there instead of up on here, so I'm gonna have to do a little bit of Photoshop magic for the thumbnail. But other than that, I am ready to go in and see what kind of Halloween goodness is in store at Battlefield Mall in Springfield, Missouri. Hopefully, it's lots of awesomeness that I can buy. <laughs> All right, the old Sears, guys. Whoa, uh, I wish that was outside blowing around. Okay, let's go on in. Holy crap, this place is enormo. And look at this, we have Monty right up front. I don't know that we've gone in any stores where Monty has been like front and center right when you walk in the door. How are you, sir? He's working, but he's pretty quiet. I love these rolling carts. If I find anything I'm gonna buy, I'm gonna need to come up here and get one of these. Oh, I hear Punchy over here saying bad words. We do not have Possessed Pumpkin here, and I do not see Lord Farquaad either. Wow, we don't even have Grim set up, but that's okay. Let's go over here and see Punchy, AKA Half a Head. Come on now, Punchy, come on. All right, come on. I think he's on the sensor but because he keeps just going off randomly. Here we go. Round and round and round I go. Where I stop, soon you'll know. <laughs> I don't know if I want to buy Punchy this year or not. I kind of do, like I love him. I guess the only thing I don't really love is that the parachute is just kind of like wonky. Like a lot of times when I see him, it's deflated. And I don't know if that's just something that happens with these or what. But anyways, all right, let's move on here, guys. Holy crap, look at this. Speaking of punchy, they have four of them right here in stock. Right next to four deadly creepers. Holy crap. While we're looking, let's go to the other side because we have three nozzles over here, too. I love when I walk in stores and I see tons of animatronics stacked up, waiting to be sold. Look at this, guys. We have not seen this little fellow blown up in any stores. It's the pumpkin stack inflatable. Oh, and we got the little ghost over here. Hello, ghosty fellow. You tried to scare me with that look on your face, but it didn't work. We don't have anybody over here, but we do have the Chains of Death. I would die if I looked on here and it literally said, Chains of Death, five dollars. All right, guys, let's head through the tunnel with the bubbles of death. We do have all four of them working here. It looks like this is only partially put together. But anyways, we do have Mr. Hairdo here. Mr. Hairdo, are you gonna work? I guess he's not gonna work. Never mind, he's working, guys. Check him out, Mr. Hairdo with a light up face. What's his name? Mr. Shorty. Mr. Shorty. I call him Young Hairdo. <laughs> All right, let's keep on moving, guys. Look who we have set up here. This is funny. It, I don't know if they like sold out of everything else that was sitting here, but they only have two. They have Reagan over here and they have Hot Nozzles. Let's come over and see Hot Nozzles. All right, Hot Nozzles. Oh. Okay, so there's the thing for hot nozzles. I'm not gonna reach in there. I'd have to get down on my knees, and I'm a big fat guy, so I wouldn't be able to get back up. But look at this guy with his giant jalapeno nose. And let's come ahead over here and visit Reagan. Look at her. See if we can get her going. Are you gonna work, Reagan? Okay, she's not gonna work. Gee, bummer. All right, I do hear electricity happening over here, so let's go through the electrical room of death. Oh, look at this, only one of them is electrifying over here. But the uh, the monitors are working. Is the floor buzzing? I hear it. 
Oh yeah, this one's buzzing here, but not the other one. And then we have one electrifying electrifier over here working. Wait, now that I look down there, I see more of them working, including this one. Ah! Wait a minute. All right, come on, electrify me. Ah! We have these hanging ghouls. Wait a minute, let's see if the Reaper works. The Reaper does not work. I don't think I've been in one store this season, guys, where the Reaper was actually working. And I think it comes down to like, you know, that little thing you're supposed to pull out. Maybe it's inside, I don't know. Anyways, bye. Okay, we have, <laughs> we have three Montes over here. We have plenty, a whole plethora of the sinister spirit dolls. And then over here we have a sound sandworm groundbreaker waiting for a new home. Are you looking for some ground to break, sir? All right, let's move on through the store, guys. We have all these hanging little ghoulies here. We got the masks over here. Look at this. We got some Chuckies over here. Um, let's see. What do we want to look at first? All right, let's just start with the Tiny Terrors. We have the Sam Sidesteppers. We have the Frankenstein Sidesteppers. Let's see if they'll work. Frankie, no. Sam, yes. Go for it, Sam. Okay, sounds good. And then we have the Pennywise sidestepper. Let's see if he'll work. Oh, yep, here he goes. He's not sidestepping, though. He's laughing, but he's not sidestepping. Okay, then down there, let's see. We have more Frankenstein. We have more Sams here. We have Crouchy statues right there. Tons of Sam statues here. Michael Myers statues, I guess that's what you would call it, the Michael Myers bust where he's carving the pumpkin. We have an Annabelle over here. We have Chucky greeters over here, as well as animated Chuckies. Oh, look at all this. We have a Spiky and the Slim sidesteppers. There goes Slim. Let's see if Spiky's gonna work. I can hear him, but Spiky's not sidestepping. Okay, sir, you let us down. Wow, this is a pretty enormous store, guys. Apparently, there's another one like three minutes away that is just the costume and mask shop. We are not going to go over there today. We're just going to look in this one just because I have about a three-hour drive ahead of me. But look at this. We have two Annabelles over here. And we have Billy Butcherson up here waiting for us. There we go. I think Billy Butcherson is the only sidestepper I have right now, guys. We have more Sams over here. We have Sam by the lamp post. We have the snow globes from Killer Clowns from Outer Space. Oh, look at this. We haven't seen this in every store this year. It's the It Chapter 2 Pennywise something statue. <laughs> Lots of Hocus Pocus stuff. I'm pretty sure these stores stocked up on the Hocus Pocus this year since there's a new movie out, which I still haven't seen. We got the Sam plush down here. Let's see what we have over here. We have hanging Sams over here with the basketball head. We have hanging ghost faces. And once again, Monty's cage is empty. Of course, we saw Monty way up at the front of the store this time, so obviously he's not going to be right here. It's pretty amazing now towards the end of the season to see so many of these shirts in stock with how difficult they were to find at the beginning of the season. They got some Michael Myers left. They got some screen masks left. All right, let's venture down this way. They have lots and lots of Camp Crystal Lake, Friday the 13th, Jason Voorhees stuff. Masks and machetes and shirts and jerseys and costumes. And, of course, they also have a ton of Chucky stuff, as always. I think this Chucky axe is way cool. <laughs> They got a handful of Freddy things. I don't see the Nightmare on Elm Street 4 mask. And I see only one style of the glove over here. Of course, they'll have lots of killer clown stuff. They always do, including the acid pie. And look over here. They have one, two, three, four of the inflatables. Let's see if they have any green oogie boogies. And no, I don't see any. <laughs> this is a huge store, though, so they might be in a different area. Of course, we have Zero with his little pumpkin nose. I don't know why there's a bag on that one. We also have Sally and Jack. And then we have the other Zero down here, which is plush, but he's also a backpack. We have the Jack bouncy head pillows. 
This store is absolutely packed with costumes and everything else you could need for whatever you want to dress up as for Halloween. They got tons of blood over here. They have fake scars over here and liquid latex. You got all kinds of paint and hair paint over here and gloves and all kinds of stuff. And what is this crazy fellow over here? Is this one of those newfangled robots that goes around the store and hands you things? It reminds me of something you'd see on Star Wars. Like this totally looks like two eyes sticking out here. Anyways, let's make our way to the other side of the store here, guys, and see what kind of awesomeness they have over there. All right, look over here, guys. We have a whole plethora of headstones here. We haven't spent a whole lot of time looking at these. This one just says R.I.P., and it has the gold candles on it. That's kind of cool. We got a cross here. We got the gargoyle here. Smaller ones along the top, and I believe that these are all just... Yeah, these are all like foam, so you'd probably have to glue like a wooden back on them or something if you really wanted them to last. Of course, there are tons more over here, and I like these posts. They say welcome, and they have skulls on top and chains. So like you put one here and one here, and there's a chain that goes through it. Okay, so we have Rosalie here. And we have the decrepit Hana doll, which we all call now Decrepit Donna. You know what? Let's leave them some stickers right down here. We have the Hall of Bad Breath here, and I do see this double-headed guy, but I do not see the hook eye guy or the hook head hog. Looks like we have a whole bunch of uh, inflatables over here, including several fright in the box. We got a couple of ghost face. We got the coffin, which is pretty dang awesome. The ghost, we have, oh, we already said ghost face. We got the haunted trees, more coffins up there, more ghosts. Those are the small ones. I think this one over here is the bigger one. Oh, wow, there's even more fright in a the box. There's like one, two, three, four. There's five fright in a box there. And then let's see, we have scarecrow archways down down here, jack-o'-lantern archways, and scary clown archways. And we have the secret keeping cat. And we also have a bucket. We're gonna put him right below the secret keeping cat with some stickers. Please don't tell anyone. We got a fogging skull pile here. We have a couple of these pumpkin lights, which I think are totally awesome. We have the vampire door knockers, but I do not see the devil door knockers, thank God. And we have reaper inflatables. You know what, let's put you right down here by the stickers, just because. Wait, I almost missed these guys over here. Look at this, holy crap. We have one, two, three, four pumpkin nester dolls. And we have an Uncle Charlie here. It's the only Uncle Charlie. And we have some zombie babies here. Of course, it's the spider biter Billy and the crawling I'm mad at everything. All right, let's keep moving, see what else we have here, guys. Whole bunch of swinging props. We got the swinging witch, the creepy crimson girl on a swing. Is that it? Do we have any empty soul girls here? I don't see any. Oh yeah, there is one on the other side there. Oh, look at this, guys. They actually have a couple of these universal bag clips in here. One, two, three, four. I have a whole package to open, and I'll be opening those on my other channel, That Nate Guy on Halloween. So go over there and subscribe, and you can see if I get them all. What in the world is this? Groovy knee dough glob. Whoa. What the heck? That is totally weird. They got a purple one and a pink one, and here's a yellow one, and they got an orange one. What the heck? That is so strange. All right, let's take a look around here real quick. Holy crap, look how many plush crouchies they have. They have three plush skellies. One, two, three, and we have one, two, three, four, five, six plush crouchies. Wow. I was thinking about getting a doormat for my office, but I'm just not sure exactly which one. How strange, a small boy just came up to me and told me he has a YouTube channel, and I asked him what it is, and he said, it's a secret. Have you been talking to this small boy? That was too funny, guys. All right, anyways, let's see. We have a whole bunch of the fleece throws here, including this one that I think I just looked at for the first time the other day, the Edgar Allan Poe, quote, the Wraithen Nevermore. I do like this haunted mansion pillow too. I wonder if this glows in the dark. Never thought about that before, but let's see. 
Hmm, it doesn't say, but that kind of looks like it glows in the dark. It would be sweet if this Chucky one glowed in the dark. Excuse me, sir, I'd like a cheeseburger. You can bring it to my room. Lettuce, but no pickle. Let's leave some stickers down here, and let's leave some here. All right, guys, I think that I have seen everything in here that I want to see. I haven't seen anything that I haven't seen except for maybe this right here. What the heck is this? Is this Haunted Mansion? It's like a... Uh, a lantern. It is. It's a Haunted Mansion lantern. I have not seen that. There's not a try me button on it. Does it open? Ooh, look at that. I guess you put a real candle in there and it lights it up. How cool is that? I have not seen that in any other stores. That is absolutely the best part about going to so many different stores, guys. You get to see so many different things and there's always something that I haven't seen. And before I go, I definitely have to take one more look. You guys are probably tired of hearing about it. Ah, here we go, the shrunken head. I'm still on the search, guys. I'm still so blown away that they didn't put any shrunken heads in the stores this year. Wait a minute, let's come over here one last time, guys, because I haven't spent any time in the mask section. And I kind of want to see, just for the heck of it, if they would happen to have that other Freddy Krueger mask over here. And look at this. This is, I think, only the second time I've seen this rabbit scarecrow mask. And it's got that moving jaw. That is totally cool. I love that. Anyways, all right, let's keep looking here. Well, wait a minute. Look at this. This is a, okay, it says scarecrow set. But you guys tell me, who is that? That, <laughs> that is an animatronic that we know. Or is it? It looks exactly like an animatronic that I'm thinking of. Anyways, let's keep on looking. I just want to see if they have that uh, Nightmare on Elm Street 4 mask, and I am not seeing it. They might have it over here, though. Hold on. We are not done with the masks. They do have ham skins. All right, let's see. Is it over here? No, huh, surprisingly, they do not have it. It could just be sold out though. You never know, we are getting closer to Halloween. So everybody's been in here shopping, buying up everything they want and everything that they need, including a banana hat. All right, well, that is another store down, guys. And this was store number 81. Can you believe that? We have filmed 81 stores, guys. All right, guys, that was an awesome store. Battlefield Mall. Springfield, Missouri. I think that's right. <laughs> I can't even remember. I've been to so many of these stores, I just don't even remember. Anyway, stick around. We have 19 more stores to go, guys. Holy crap. We've been to 81 of these stores. Mm -hmm.